everyone, Ms. Moody here, District Librarian. Um, today I'm going to read, it's actually part of a series, these itty bitty bios, and this one is Coretta Scott King, who's truly one of my personal heroes. Um, what it doesn't mention in the book is that every year there are um, awards, and they're called the Coretta Scott King Book Award Books, and these are books written by African American authors and illustrators. It's a very prestigious, very important award, and these books are beautiful. One of my favorite lessons is to bring these books in and share them with classrooms. So at the end of this video, you're gonna see students um, that I was fortunate enough to go into their classroom with and share these books. So hope you enjoy. My itty bitty bio, Coretta Scott King. Table of contents. My story. I was born in Alabama in 1927. I had two sisters and one brother. I did well in school. I studied music in college. Why should people do well in school? I continued my study of music in Boston, Massachusetts. I met Martin Luther King Jr. We got married. We moved to Alabama. He led our church. He was the pastor. I helped him lead. How does a good leader act? Black people in the United States have been treated unfairly. Back then, my husband wanted to change this. I wanted to change this too. Many people threatened us. I fought for justice. I wanted equal rights for black men and women. What other groups of people are treated unfairly? My husband died. Someone killed him because of his ideas. I started a group for social change. I spoke about equal rights around the world. I made Martin Luther King Jr. Day a holiday. On this day, we celebrate equal rights. This day teaches us to celebrate other races. I died in 2006. I helped all kinds of people. I wanted peace around the world. What would you like to ask me?